Am I too old to start a YouTube channel or a small business? I'll try to help answer that question coming up. If you're not a subscriber yet, be sure to hit that uh, subscribe button down below and ring that bell icon so you'll be notified every time a new video comes out. Unless you are moving to a place like this in the next day or two, then no, it's not too late. Even these old trucks have a story to tell, something to share. So yes, you could start a YouTube channel or even a small business if that's what you want to do. You are not too old. Like these trucks, you're still here. So who says you're too old to start a business or a YouTube channel? The people that are jealous because you want to do something? The people that want to keep you down? There is a fella that I know for a fact that is 74 years old who has a YouTube channel and a fairly successful one. I'll put his name and link down there in the description below. His name's Rusty, but there's some numbers that go with it. Rusty 77 something. I can't remember that exactly. Now that, that is one disadvantage of becoming older. Some things you just can't quite remember as well as you used to be able to, but you can still remember. You can still do things. If you can walk and talk and look and push a button, you can YouTube and start your own YouTube channel. Man, the older people may have a lot more to share than the younger people because the older people have some really cool stories that a lot of people would like to know. What may not mean much to you might mean a lot to somebody else. Tell you what, this wind is kind of bad and the sun's going down. But don't let people keep you down and say you're too old because you're not too old to start a YouTube channel or a business. You know, basically YouTube channel is a business because believe me, you put a lot of work into it. A lot of time goes into it. Now, I've never been a business owner so I didn't quite get that, but if this is anything like being a business owner, even somebody as small as me on the YouTube, there's a lot of work, a lot of videoing, a lot of editing, a lot of research, just a whole lot of things. But enjoy what you're doing. Don't do it to make a dollar. If you're doing it to make a dollar, go find yourself a well-paying job and live your life. If you're doing it because you enjoy doing it and you really like doing all the little things like the editing and the going to places and coming up with ideas and sharing them with everybody, if that's why you're doing it, who cares if you wind up having a million subscribers? Enjoy it. Have fun with it. You ain't six foot under. So you're not too old to start a YouTube channel or a small business. And you know, another thing about it that just came to mind is, uh, you know, they say do word games like Scrabble and Word Find and things like that to keep your mind sharp. Well, there you go. This right here will keep your mind sharp because you have to you have to think about things. You have to think about what to say and how to say it and sometimes research things. It's not just to sit on the couch and watch life go by type of deal. You know, who wants to do that? I certainly don't. Well, i tell you what, the fish aren't biting, so let's head to the office and talk some more about this. Because I'm really passionate about it. You know, there's so much to do and learn and share with others. You know, why not do it? Why sit around on the house, or sit around in the house, on the couch, thinking, well, what could I do today? And then you wind up, doing nothing. 
You didn't even, you, I mean, you can edit videos if you don't, if you only have enough energy to go do something for a few minutes, go do it. Share what you've done. Video it. Document it. Then you can go back to the house and sit on the couch and edit it. That don't take much energy. It does take some thinking power, and that's what's going to keep your mind going. Don't grow old thinking you wished you'd have done this or wished you'd have done that. Because believe me, there, I'm 55, okay? There's a lot of things that I said now, or I think, look back at now, I wished I would have done. And now it's not too late, but there's, you know, you have financial responsibilities that prevent you from doing certain things. So, if you're younger, don't let these moments pass you. And if you're older, like me, or even older, don't think you can't do it. Do what you can do. Share what you can share. You know, your kids or grandkids or great-grandkids may enjoy watching you on the video and saying, that's my grandpa. You know, they might forget what your voice sounds like. They might forget what you really look like and how you act in your body language and your smiles and your, you know, the, your different looks. Capture those moments and share them. Share them with the world. Yeah, let's head to the office. I'll see y'all there. So I hope y'all got something out of the video today and hope y'all act on it. You know, don't sit around and grow old. You know, age is just a number, but a mentality can uh, determine your age. If you think old, you're going to become old. I'm not saying run around and act like a teenager, but live your life. It's not over yet. So if you're going to jump into this YouTube game, and start making YouTubes, I tell you a good tool to use is called TubeBuddy. It's a browser plugin that will help you research keywords and help you come up with titles and things such as that. And if you want to check it out, look down in the description and there'll be a link to it down below. So in the meantime, y'all give it some thought. Get up off the couch. Go do something. Have an adventure. Even if you just, oh Lord, going to Walmart nowadays is an adventure. Trouble is, you have to stand in line sometimes. Anyway, y'all keep on keeping on. We'll see y'all down the road. Bye.